Morning! Oh my god, look at my hair. Let's really go for the psychotic Chuckle Brother look. There we go! Man, that takes me back. Um, this word, I'm going to find a word. This word here is going to help you write an email or a piece of social media content for your audience today. <laughs> it's a man. Clapperton. I don't remember that one. Need to read that. Um, Clapperton. So that's a man's name. We could go with Clapper or Ton. But let's just go with Clap. Clap's quite a good one. Let's write... Let's write a kind of congratulatory email, right? No, pump up your audience a little bit. Don't be fake about this. It's like, you know, they're not walking on the moon or anything like that. They've signed up for your lead magnet to learn how to create their own one-man mariachi band. So they've not taken a huge amount of action, but they've still taken action. And if you think about what it actually takes, we think of it as a small thing. You know, when you're in marketing, if somebody gives you an email address and joins your email list, we think of it as the smallest action they can take. But if you think about what's really going on, for somebody to do that, for somebody to give you their email address, they need to have a gap in their life, realise there's a gap in their life, spot the problem, want to do something about it, start to think about how to solve the problem. Not many people take action and actually do that. Then they've got to look for possible solutions, varying solutions. Then they've got to weigh them all up, think about them. And then they've got to decide on a few and take action and explore people to solve that problem with. By joining your email list, they've actually decided to, I'm solving this problem, it's a valuable problem. This person I think can help me, I'm gonna give them a chance. It might just be, oh, they gave me their email address, they're on my list to you. But to them, that's about five or six steps. So write an email to them, write a piece of social content or anything like that. Just giving them a bit of a pat on the back for, remind them of the action they've taken to do this, the steps they've taken to be where they are now. They might not have bought your full course, doesn't matter, but they're ahead of most. Don't pump this up, don't fake it like you're the greatest hero the world has ever seen, but be genuine about this. They've taken action, not many people are prepared to look into the, the abyss, the void of their life and think, man, I've got problems, let alone take action, the first step to solve it. And you can't take the second step without the first. So give them a bit of a pat on the back and then finish off the email. And this would be great for a PS. It's like just a really soft selling PS. Of course, when you are ready, if you're ready, here's a few ways we can work together. That kind of thing. So that'd be the email I sent today. Clap at them. Um, give them a pat on the back, but be genuine about it. Don't be a sleazy sleazeball. Lovely hair.